Megan, it's so nice to meet you. You too. Have you in the UK? I've been listening to your album. Oh. And I love it. It's Thank fun, you. it's sassy, it's just what we need in awesome. the winter here. <laughs> what was it like for you kind of putting together this album? There must have been so much pressure having such a huge first single, following it up, and then you've got this album to produce. What was that like? Yeah, uh, the song All About The Bass kind of blew up while I was working on my album, but um, I finished it pretty quickly. The, out, the label pressured me to finish it right now. And they knew I could do it because I was a songwriter first, mm -hmm. pop star second. But when you have an opportunity to say something to the world and you know they're listening, you want it to be good. So I did a lot of different topics. Um, I kept it all upbeat and happy and fun. And I kept it conversational. Mm -hmm. And lyrically, I know everyone says it's relatable, but this stuff is relatable on a different level, like the walk of shame <laughs> and 3 a.m. And um, those love songs, they talk about how the boy is actually a good person mm -hmm. and a gentleman, which is very important. Well, like you said, you were songwriter first because you kind yeah. of just came and blew up over here with, yeah. <laughs> with your first song. And we were like, whoa, where did she come from? And you must have worked with some amazing people while you were songwriting. Yeah. Is there anyone who you haven't worked with yet who you'd like to work with? Bruno Mars. I would <laughs> love to write with him. I think he's a genius. And obviously, we've heard all about this duet with Harry, and everyone must have asked you mm -hmm. about it, Harry Styles. But Everybody. I have to ask you anyway because everyone wants to know, yeah. are we going to hear it? I really hope so. We just have to find the right production and the right people to sing it. And it's a beautiful song. It's called Someday Maybe. Would you so two not Someday do it? Maybe, <laughs> you'll get to hear it. What wow. about you two? Could you two not do it? Well, it depends on where we are in our careers and um, what time we got. <laughs> like my single with, John, I mean, my song with John Legend, I don't know when it can be a single because I have to make sure he's free, you know? Because yeah. we both have different paths. It's crazy. Well, when you first got your number one, what was the first thing you treated yourself to? Well, I haven't made a lot of money yet, so <laughs> I haven't bought a car okay. or a fancy house. I still live in a very crappy apartment. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine. Um, I did start, I have started taking, like whenever we go out to dinner, I do pay for it, for my <laughs> brothers. So we went to a nice cheesecake factory dinner. I don't know if you nice. have those here. Well, I don't think we have cheesecake. I always hear about them in America. I oh, wish we did. Huge. I love you get cheesecake. meals like this big, it's bomb. I love it's like cheesecake. America. It's great. We just, yeah, we basically go out. And now I'm 21, so we go out and drink. Have a good time. It's beautiful. <laughs> over here, you're fine. You're fine Yeah, over I've been here. Five for, fine yeah. for years over here, but exactly. I'm finally here now at 21. Come it's here great. and have No one time. cards me. It's ridiculous. <laughs> Don't I look 17? No. You, you do look young. Thanks. And we forget that you're so young because you've done, you're having this amazing career yeah. already. So we kind of forget. But you are, you do sound like you're having a lot of fun. What is the most fun thing that you have done since it all kind of blew up? Well, I get to travel the world. I'm in London. I just went on um, the London Eye. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I have to do the London Eye when you I come have to London. To. Yeah. It was great. It was beautiful. What a cool experience. Um, cool things that I've done. I've hung out with some celebrities, mm -hmm. did the Jingle Ball tour. Got to meet Sam Smith. Well, who's the, the most fun one then? I've heard you. Sam been and Rita out with Ora. Them. We're definitely like the British ones, man. They're my favorite people ever. We had a blast. Yeah. And what is the most embarrassing thing you would say has happened to you since it's all kind of gone crazy? Most embarrassing? Yeah, thing? is there anything kind of you're like, oh, I hope that one doesn't come out? Oh, pictures? Oh, yeah, actually, definitely on Instagram. My fans think that I'll love this. I don't love it uh, when they find pictures of me in middle school and high school, like very throwback <laughs> pictures, and they post them on Instagram. Yeah, we and don't go, how cute is she when she was in her awkward phases? <laughs> I'm like, no. <laughs> and she, they even mentioned, like, I hope you like my throwbacks. I'm like, Bleh. would you like your throwbacks up there for the world? That's one of the unfortunate things, that's, isn't it, that's of being it. in the limelight. There it is. See, mine will stay hidden, I hope. No, so that's like, fine. I'm going to look for fine. them now. No, no, I'm no. Dig deep. No, no, no. <laughs> mom couldn't tell my mom to keep them hidden. Um, we've seen Jessie J do this party trick recently, which is singing with her, her mouth, mouth closed. closed. I just saw that this yeah, morning. And it's so cool. Have you got any party tricks like that? No. Nothing? I can't. I mean, they you, made you're me have sing. To find one. They made me sing this morning with my mouth, with my lips closed. Okay. Because they're like, can you sing without your lips being lips like, moving. moving? Yeah. I did it. You want me to do it? Yeah, do it, do it. <sighs> Okay, um You can do me down here to na 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 to na na Oh the smell of your car so good da 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 Good mm. job. 
Good job. It's really hard. Yeah, I was going to try it later, but <laughs> I can't probably do, like, won't goodbyes. now. You had to go like goodbye. Well, I That's had to go hard. earlier because I thought, you well, did? obviously I'm going to go and see you and Lips, Lips Moving is the new single. So let's see what we can do with the lips not moving. All right, your turn. But no, it just sounds like I'm humming. Oh, does it? I was, yeah, it was just You got to like, move the tongue. It's all about the tongue. It's all about that yeah, tongue. Yeah, but I can't sing anyway. So <laughs> <laughs> it's just like... Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, it's, it's awful. Oh. It's awful. <laughs> I mean, you can't even work out what I'm saying. So, anyway, I saw this great quote from Brittany yesterday, which made me laugh. Um, and it was, life is short, smile while you still have teeth. Are there any silly little quotes which you think you could live your life by or that you think, yeah, they're, they're, they're good ones to live by? I think smiling while you still have your teeth is good. That's amazing. Yeah. That's so true and on point. I don't know, if all my quotes that I know are like very serious, the one on my Instagram says, Work until you no longer have to introduce yourself. And I, I put that up there when I just got the record deal. You're almost there. And now, yeah, yeah much people there. know my name. Yeah. It's so funny because I'll still be like, hey, I'm Megan. They're like, no, we know. I'm like, yes, <laughs> did it. We touched on earlier your fans are called the Megatrons. Megatrons. Which is an amazing name. Thank you. It's like the best <laughs> name for fans ever. I love They're it. They're like Transformers. Yeah. I love that. With the Z though, so I don't yeah, have to pay them. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> or get sued. <laughs> um, have they done any kind of crazy stuff? Because they are crazy about you. Oh yeah. Well, my little brother will send me like screenshots of Instagram accounts that are like, um, I obey Megan, and I die for Megan, and all these crazy things. And they'll put up a picture of me, one of them, and say like, I can't live without this smile. And and just adorable, and, and my my little brother's like, I think they've taken this too far. <laughs> I'm like, oh, what is he? He's a uh, about to be nineteen. So not nothing too crazy then. Nothing. They haven't given you anything, no. kind of. I I like, received um cookies and letters and they're, they're nice things, though. but they're, they're very nice. They're, they're like, sweet. you saved my life. Yeah. I love myself. It's great. That's cool. And obviously, we've touched on you meeting icons and uh, hanging out with all these amazing celebrities. Who is it who inspires you the most? Bruno Mars. So you he want to work with Bruno, and he inspires you. I want to be I mean, the girl version awesome. of Bruno Mars. I think he, he's amazing. He could do whatever he wants and be completely successful with it. He just did um, The Voice the other day with those um, hot rolls in his head. I didn't see that. You have to look that up. <laughs> I, I watched that. it on the screen, and I thought it was sound check. Okay. And they're like, nope, that's that's the show. And well, I was like, you he come can up, literally do whatever he wants. You've come up that same route as him, the songwriter, the performer. Yeah. The, and you're he there. does every genre. I want to do that. You're there. Be... You're there, Megan. Oh, okay. I'm Bruno, Mom. I made it. Did you, you hear? You've done it. I did it. <laughs> uh, it was a pleasure talking to you. You too. Good luck with the new single, Thank with you the so album. Much. Check and it out. Yeah. Title. <laughs> oh. Thank you, Megan. Thank you. <laughs>